Hi, it's John Binney and I wanted to share two awesome experiences that I had this week. The first of which was attending an amazing talk from the fabulous uh, Louisa, a uh, Scottish geologist. I follow her on Instagram. She's also on TikTok. And she gave a really incredible talk on the his history of geology in, in Scotland. So we learned all about the different regions um, of the country, how the highlands were formed, how they used to reach, off, reach out across um, Europe and um, they are connected into, into North America also. We also learned about um, how the Castle Rock at Edinburgh was formed and how to uh, find um, crystals and uh, amazing things within rocks. And just what really inspires me about Louisa is her like, she just has this incredible um, passion for, for her, her subject. And in social media and in our modern society, there's not a lot of passion about what lies right beneath our feet right now. And it is so cool to see someone like engaging, especially uh, being Scottish and connecting into the land that we love and live in. And I really love the way that she sees, um, you know, time in geology terms uh, really flows like, like water. Like you just see this incredible pattern of um, movements of, of rocks of all the different types, like sedimentary, um, igneous, which I'm probably saying wrong, and uh, also um, uh, uh, tran trans or metamorphic. Um, rock. I'm trying to learn these terms <laughs> and probably probably get them all wrong. Um, but yeah, it's really incredible to, to see. And as a musician and as a, an energy healer, I'm really keen to uh, learn more myself. I love learning more about crystals and I love, I love touching uh, rocks. There's so many beautiful um, stones and rocks around, around Scotland. It's such an incredible, diverse landscape. And yeah, really excited to, to practice that as well. I'm going to practice like putting my hands onto to rocks and feeling their, their energy. And it's everything, right? Like we have a stone wall here in our garden, which I'm very lucky to have, um, which is quarried, I believe, from, um, it'll be either the North Bright Law Hill or the Traprain Law at, at Haddington. And I want to find out all about their journeys, like ask, talk to the rocks and ask them. And I'd also like to share, uh, my experience of, of seeing the incredible um, Laura uh, Silverson playing uh, live at the Edinburgh Festival. Uh, and I saw her yesterday in the Royal Mile in Edinburgh, and it was just. Wow, it just like makes my soul melt. It's. It's so beautiful, so rich, and she sings with such depth and, and passion. And her journey is incredible. Like she has this little diagram on her guitar case of where she's driven in her, in her van around Europe. And she like posts each day about how many miles she's done, um, like where, what the songs are that she's, she's uh, creating. And her guitar playing is, is incredible as well. It's, it's, a, it's a style that's new to me. And I really love like the, this kind of, this huge universe that it opens up for, for her music. So definitely check out her music and I'm looking forward to, um, uh, to, to finding out more as well about her music. I've only listened to maybe a handful of songs uh, over and over and I want to expand out my, my listening. And what, it, what inspired me about meeting both of these amazing characters is that for Louisa, she is just living her passion as a geologist and just loving this this beautiful country that we live in and she's so grateful for, for what she has. And it's that passion that is just sparking, you know, her, her life and everyone that connects with her. Um, it's, she has like this massive social media following and it's like, that's so beautiful because it's because of her passion, right? It's because she's just this incredible bright, bright soul. Oh, I almost got it. Um, and then, and, uh, for, for Laura as well, like I felt like the, uh, the really cool thing is that her, 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 her lifestyle at the moment is, is one that really resonates with me. My, my wife and I um, are preparing for a European trip uh, where I'll go out and create you know, music every day. Uh, we'll go around in our uh, camping van and explore new places. And yeah, really excited to, to do that. And, and Laura's living that dream right now. 
And, you know, it's a journey of ups and downs. And of course, we know uh, from being kind of weekend warriors or traveling each weekend that there's a lot to, to navigate, a lot of challenges to overcome. But um, I'm excited for that too, <laughs> all the ups and the downs. And I also was asking um, myself, like, you know, my, my shadow who's been coming out of this hermit mode. And what really surprised me was that a lot of that hermit, like that, that kind of anxiety about being around other people, wasn't directly connected with my my music or worried about playing in front of others. It's more just putting myself out there, meeting others, and being around big crowds of people. And so I did that for uh, at least the last two days, and it feels amazing. Like it feels like I I want to do more. I want to meet more people and get more selfies with <laughs> with people that are just these are just stars in my universe like um like Louisa and and, and, and Laura and uh yeah I'm also really excited to um to do more music in, in public and that'll be my next thing there might be an opportunity on Saturday I'm going to look into that and if not I'll be taking my guitar and just busking out in the street which is just so much fun playing music for for the people live and yeah, I love that, you know, the universe is showing me like, you know, people that inspire me, people that are, you know, living their dream and so passionate about what they do and also, you know, choosing a life and a lifestyle that, that supports that is just incredible to see. So, yeah, I thought I'd share that. And uh, if you if you haven't already, please, please take a look at um, their, their social media um, uh, accounts uh, and they're all amazing content for... Uh, Louisa and um, and Laura and I hope that this finds you well. Sending my love from Scotland. Love you. <laughs>